when, when it comes down to coming to Grenada, certainly the, the Caribbean experience is really very good. Basically, we've got sea all around us, so the sailing is amazing. Scuba diving is absolutely um, first class. We've got uh, one of the best wrecks yeah, that people can go and dive on. Um, deep sea fishing, there's whale watching. So there's lots of things to do on the sea. And then within the country itself, there's the nutmeg factory, which is absolutely fascinating. There's River Antrine Rum Distillery, which has got the oldest water wheel in the Western Hemisphere. And it's such a gorgeous country. I think uh, myself and anybody who comes here as a tourist is extremely lucky to be in Grenada because we're in the true Caribbean. Um, realistically, I know the Caribbean islands really very well because of the length of time that I've been here. And when it comes to the beauty of Grenada, the, how lovely the people are, the climate that we live in, to be in a Caribbean country is just absolutely marvellous. When you're here and you're in the hotel, the hotel environment, the, the one thing that people say about the Calabash, which is always a, a distinct memory, is how friendly the staff are and how well trained they are and how courteous they are. And the, the people here just love tourists and, and, and so actually the true Caribbean experience in Grenada. At Calabash we've got eight acres of hotel and we've got 19 acres beside it of the villas and within the hotel um, what we do in the hotel is some really nice things for tourists because what I've tried to achieve is to have a hotel that um, I'd like to stay in and the irony of that I never will do. People get up in the morning, they put on the robes, the maids come to the maids pantries and then they prepare uh, an a la carte breakfast for you and you feel very special. It's a nice way to start the day. We prepare fruit and fruit or a fruit punch and that's delivered to every guest who's on the beach and at our beach bar we always griddle everything so it's barbecue, outside cooking um, every day, which when you're on the beach and you smell the food <laughs> cooking, it's just a lovely, lovely feeling. And then at six o'clock we deliver canopies to the rooms and that will give you the opportunity to sit down and have a glass of wine or a glass of champagne before you come down to dinner in Rhodes Restaurant. And restaurants uh, are a passion of mine. And when I met um, Gary Rhodes, uh, it's like he and I were just so close together on lots of things that we thought about. Um, how to organise food and how to present food and also how to make sure that food is a very important element to all of our days. So if you have a good meal, you feel good. So to make a special occasion of a, a meal is very important. And actually what he's done is he's taken local produce and he's given it the Rhodes flair with a Caribbean twist. So in actual fact, it, it's a first-class restaurant and one that I'm very proud of. And also, Gary tells me that any of my staff he would like to employ. <laughs> so it's a win-win it's a situation for both of us.